Oh, it's a pump. Oh, man, this. Whoa, boy. What the hell is this? Is awesome. Hey, this is Ren, and welcome back to Goody Little Two Shoes. We are apparently in some kind of blasted nightmare realm. It's locked, it seems. Oh, and I bet there's something nice inside too. Yeah, I bet there is. Huh? Oh, what's this? Golden Girl, Reaper. That's what I wished for long, long ago. You wanted to be reborn? Somewhere safe, somewhere far, far away. I went through all of their trials, gathered all of his gifts, and, indeed, I was reborn. My wish was granted, and yet, yet, to think I would end up like this. Wait, what was that? That was pretty cool, whatever that was. Oh, I got some grapes. Okay. So, apparently that spooked me. It's so bright, but there's no flame. An intricately designed golden lamp stands by the bedroom door, its bulb shining bright. Alright. I feel like I'm a princess, but <laughs> I'm in a princess bedroom. If only I could live here, just like I've always dreamed. Oh! There are all sorts of dangers looking use healing items. No. I'm locked in here, I suppose. Can't say I mind it much if I'm honest. What was that? Sorry, I'm just making sure there's nothing hidden. Oh, what I would give to sleep here every night. A spacious bed stands in a corner, its silky sheets protected by a counterpane embroidered in gold thread. So I'm guessing this is where I use the key item. Maybe if I try something else. What do you mean maybe if I try something else? Oh, the key's for the chest then. Let's see. Oh goodness, so many dresses. Another key? I wonder what it's for. I do kind of hate now I have to go to the inventory to use the item. Such a long corridor. It truly feels as though I'm inside a palace. Can we quit with the giggling, please? And thank you. Can we just stop with that? <laughs> Such a strange statue. The marble statue of a serpent wearing a golden crown. Its nameplate reads, Azit? The marble statue of a crow wearing a golden crown. Its nameplate reads, Some metalcore band album cover. Can you stop that? No, no. I want to save. <gasps> I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, this is creepy. And I don't have my lantern either. What in the Lord's name is this place? What are those? Don't forget to turn on your lantern. Oh, I got my lantern back. Okay. And keep an eye out. Ow. 
now. Get away from me. So they have like an attack radius I have to get around. Four keyholes. That means there are four keys I'd wager. Yeah. An intricately designed golden lamp stands by the wall. It's bulbs emanating an eerie, phantasmagoric light. That's gonna be a very hard word for me to say. Oh boy, get away from me. I hate you. I get it, I goofed. Ooh, and I can run out of, I can lose my sanity too. Oh boy. I got a key, phantasm key. Oh, it's got a little moon and the sun on it. That's cool again. It's a key, you don't say. This is what will get me out of here, I'm certain. Well, I need three more, obviously. Grab it, grab it. Why are you like this? Oh, bandages, not what I expected. It's jammed. I could try to pry it open, but... Ah, force it open. I ain't a bubble blowing, baby. Oh, it's a note. What's this? The key to one's dream is found within oneself. As for yours, it's in this very room, the core of your innermost desires. It's not knowledge you seek, but gold bathed glory. There ain't no shame in that. That is you. No, no, piss off. All right, we need some healing items. Do I have anything that helps with my sanity as well? Nope. Let's use one. Did she just wink at me? Oh, piss off. No, not again. I'm down to one match. Well, if we get hit again, we're boned. And we will die to our sanity. Oh, I found some old bandages. Can I, can I find some matches? It's no wonder they're wilted being left in such an awful room. A bunch of purple flowers sag lazily over their vil their vase vase. Is there anything special about my? Am my sh shadow smiling and demon died? Or my, my shadow, my reflection? I got a phantasm key. It's a key. How many do I have so far? I have three, right? Nope, back. I have two. Oopsie poopsie. This seems so simple, yet I keep just absolutely getting bodied by these stupid candles. Force it open. It's a key. No, go away. So t I guess we're inside of like her, her subconscious maybe. There's some gold sparklies over there. Oh, I can cut around and behind these. That's helpful. There's something on the back of the shelf. Screw it. Go for it. A key. We're out of here, lads. This is it. It 
worked. I hope so. It seemed like that was the whole mechanic this whole time. Well, hi there. I love your ribbon. Oh. What is this? Where? Where am I? Am, I must be dreaming. Probably. Oh. Was that a hint? Do I have to control it now? Oh, I do. Do I have to avoid the creepy candles? Or do I just keep going? Yes, it's a rather nice castle. I, I comprehend. What if the maiden's not saying she got rebirthed as... Like the aura glowing maiden thing, and she actually got rebirth as Elise. <laughs> Can you not? Hurry now! Hurry now! My life has banquet. I don't. I don't know if that's the voice. We'll we'll try a few different ones as we go. We'll, we'll see. Hurry! Hurry! Should I make him creep here? <laughs> no, he's kind of giggly. Oh, we're hauling it. We're scooting. Let's go. Hey. Oh, there's a pump. Oh. Man, this. Whoa, boy. What the hell is this? This is awesome. Why is this not scaring us at all? This is cool. That was a drastic cut. Who's, who's banquet are we are we late for here? Is my question. <gasps> a dream? Yeah, most most likely. Uh... That left me feeling a little queasy. Rose and Marine? Are you there? In the attic? Mm. No point in waking her this early, I suppose. I mean, we can get, we could like, you know, cuddle. What are you? Collected fireflies, one. There's multiple endings. Are any of those knickknacks matches? Because, uh, your boy's in need. And we probably should just clean up like Granny Holly's room and let Rose have that instead of throwing her ass in the attic. Elise. Good morning, Elise. I would have gotten a head start on breakfast if I knew you'd be waking up this early. For goodness sake. Since when have you been up? Oh, I'm always up and about before daybreak. Because I'm a witch. I can't sleep in if I try. I didn't notice you coming down from the attic. I brought the ladder up with me last night so I wouldn't wake you. And the hatch doesn't squeak if you do it slowly, right? I took my shoes off and used the ladder to shut it back up easy. <laughs> You're smarter than you look, huh? Uh, are you saying she looks stupid? I look as smart as I am, Elise. Is that so? Anyhow, I'm heading off to the garden. Is it that, that obvious I haven't touched it in years? Been working like a dog since Granny Hall passed away, but... Now I have you to fret about, too. Can't sit on my hands forever, can I? He'd rather starve. <laughs> a maid of all work. Shush it, you. I'm heading out to see what I can do about the garden. I'll call you in for breakfast in a moment then. Bread. Uh, for goodness sake. I've neglected it for so long, it'll be impossible to dig. <laughs> Anyhow, this is no time to loiter about. So what do I... So what am I going to do in the garden? I'm sorry. What is this? A pair of shoes. 
How could they possibly have wound up here in my garden? Oh, oh they're wonderful. They are pretty schnazzy. And they fit me like a glove, too. These shoes. Don't you think that's weird? Like, why would you put those on? It's as though they were made for me. Yes, by the Nightmare Realm. I did it! All of Kaiferberg is here. No, they don't, because they'll say you're a fucking witch. No, go back to the garden. We had one job. You're more ADHD than me. What is this? Uh, this is a very... Are you the witch? What? Is it just like letting me know I finished the prologue and this is some kind of... Oh! I, I don't like that, actually. I don't know why. This is really hype. I'm gonna skip this. I don't think there's any like plot or lore significance. Whoa, what did I miss then? What do you mean explain myself? What the fuck did I miss? Oh shush it! What is there to explain, father? Did you not hear yourself last? Parading into Saint Walpurga's place of worship, howling and shouting like a Please, old Yachtin. Words of egotism, vanity, disdain for your fellow folk. Oh, was I like singing the beat and that bebop and tune, you know, as I went into church? Because if so, that's that's pretty bad. You old geezer. A witch. A witch of old Hall's kin. I am not a witch, you. Oh, listen here, you old wretch. That's enough. I've heard enough. Old Yakin has overstepped his boundaries. I ask that you pardon him. Yet his concerns weigh heavy, Elise. I wasn't aware singing and dancing was forbidden now, Father. Your singing was riddled with sin, lass. Vanity and lust go hand in hand with greed. You're... Oh, it. With sin, Father. This old geezer just accused me and my grandmother of witchery. And yet... <sighs> enough, Elise. Compose yourself and come inside. Your temperament is a sin in and of itself. I want to tell him just to go straight screw himself. I want the rest of his hair to fall out from the stress of me existing within his town. But I can't do anything or solve any of these mysteries so I think I'm a witch. I guess I'll cramp for something I didn't do if it makes you happy. Huh? Yet there's something I'd like to make clear to you all. You've stood witness to this foolery. You've all heard old Yakin accuse me of witchery. Hmm. That's enough, Elise. You asked me to pardon him yourself, father, and I will. Yet I demand you folks understand that this once for all. Out with it! I am not a mere maid of all work. I am one of you. And I demand right here, right now, that you start treating me as such. Very well, Elise. You have made yourself heard. I, whoa, Nelly. Without a shadow of a doubt, lass. At last. He has murderous move. Who are you? An old acquaintance of yours, lass. What? You're favored by him, Elise. Frightfully so. You're clad in his will from head to toe, inside out. And those shoes. My shoes? Those very shoes, Elise, are a testament of his gift to you. Who is he? Listen carefully now, my beautiful lass. Get away from me, you creepy old bat. Yours is his heritage, his flesh, his ardor. Don't you understand, Elise? What in the Lord's name? 
How do you know my name? His blessings, his will. He himself is writhing in your veins, lass. What do you want from me, you old hag? You must listen carefully now, my beloved. Do as I say, and he will make all of your wishes come true. What is this? My wishes, you say? Why, yes, opulence, splendor, fortune. Your deepest desires, unlike any other, at least. All right, I can't keep doing the voice right now. I don't understand. You do, Elise. Tell me. What is it you most desire? Me? Speak it, Elise. Mm. What I most desire, that's fortune. Fortunate you are, Elise. I mean, at least she's straight up with it. Deep in this woodland, there is a patron saint whose blissful words bestow a blessing upon the faithful. All that's requested in return are three gifts made from the testaments to one's desires. Reach his dwelling with all of these in hand, and your wish shall be granted. A wound, carrier of life, your basket is to hold all that is sacred. Okay then. Oh, is this like a play on Little Red like Riding Hood? <laughs> the tender flesh of earthly desire. I like tender flesh, like like berries. The sweetest nectar to be drunk in earnest. I mean, I get that says like poison, but could it also be like honey, maybe, or? You are to arrive in good company, the object of your affections. Oh, so I have to pick one of the girls I love, and that, uh, that's probably at least three of the endings, is that... You are to reach the gates of his dwelling, carrying all three gifts. Voice your innermost desire, surrender yourself wholly to his grace. And fortune you shall attain, for such is his blessing, and such is your desire. Elise. An old hag's tale. Oh, cool. Elise, are you listening? No, I'm currently communing with Satan. Where did she go? Elise. Oh, are you all right, Elise? Where did that old hag go? Elise? Elise. What's the matter with you? Leb Cohen. Oh, I'm sorry, Leb. Who the hell Dorothea? It's best we let her rest for a while. We can sit with you, Elise. Oh, it's best we give her some space. Jacob. She is communing with Satan. Uh. I'm all right. I felt a little dizzy is all. I can bring you some water, Elise. As for me, I'll be in the church, waiting to have a word with you. Don't you start, Lub. Oh, I've already started. Maya, now you've done it, Elise. For goodness sake. Montag. I am starving. I am absolutely famished. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to, go ahead and like and subscribe. And if you would please share it with a friend, that'd be a huge help. And once again, thank you and just have an absolutely amazing day.